everyone, in this video I'm going to be unboxing two new Geek Gear boxes that they have come out with. This one is the You've Been Accepted box and it's basically just like a acceptance letter box with other goodies inside. So you're going to get your personalized acceptance letter and all that in this box and it is available on their website now. And then this one is the new limited edition one which will have a theme and this box's theme is Hogwarts Express. So everything in this box will be related to the Hogwarts Express. And the next theme will be house elves. So everything will be related to house elves. And they only have 2,000 of each box that they come out with, which is every two to three months. And the house elves box is already on sale. So if you're into that, I'm going to leave all the pricing and other information in the description box. And if you use my code PotterThings20, it'll save you 20% off. So let's get started with the You've Been Accepted box. So let's talk about the box itself. I mean, look at that packaging. I love the border. And then it even says you are special, you are magic. And then the best part is you've been accepted with the Hogwarts castle. That is so cute. This would make the cutest birthday gift. I mean, could you imagine if you knew someone who was turning 11 and they got this? I, that would be so cool. Or at any age, I mean, we all want our Hogwarts acceptance letter at some point, so it would make a great birthday gift. And then once you open the box, right off the top is the Hogwarts acceptance letter, and it even has a little Hogwarts crest wax seal, so it's official. And the envelope feels really nice. It's like textured and thick. And then you can personalize this bit. And then let's see if I can not destroy. Oh, look, it comes off. So you can save that. <laughs> Let me try not to ruin it. I'll be right back. And I'm in and I didn't rip anything, which is surprising. So it looks like they used aged looking paper. So it looks more authentic. And this is the acceptance letter. I'm not going to read it, but that is what it looks like. And again, you can personalize it there. You can put your name on the website before you get it. And this must be the list of materials you'll need for your first year at Hogwarts. And the paper is good quality. It's like thick, so it won't easily rip or anything. So that's really nice. So then, there is more in the box. It looks like, oh, another box of magical treats. I got this in the regular, I think the regular Geek Gear box for March. It's Professor's Sherbet Lemons. So this will come in handy on the ride to Hogwarts. Let me open it again so you can see what they look like if you didn't watch that video. Okay, there we go. They're individually wrapped, so that's convenient. All these worms. And then we have a chocolate frog box. I got one of these in my March box, which, it, which I just opened, so I'll open this box because I already opened it. <laughs> but they're actual chocolate frogs and it comes with four of them so i'll show you them if you haven't watched that video it should be up already but there's four of them one on each side i haven't pried them apart but they're actual little chocolate frogs and then we have another suite and this is fever fudge this is actually new to me they haven't put it in a different geek gear box or anything like that and i've never tried fever fudge before i know they sell them at the parks but i never bought it i have tried sherbet lemons and chocolate frogs at the parks so i'm excited to have a version of fever fudge and can we just talk about the packaging with geek gear they always nail it it's so cute i love that so we have four fever fudges and I'm not going to taste anything because I just, I'm not in the mood to have any sweets right now, but I assume each is a different flavor and I can already smell cinnamon. So I'm, I'm guessing the red side is cinnamon and the blue side, it's, it just smells sweet. It kind of smells like bubble gum. So 
I'm assuming it's bubblegum, but the red side is definitely cinnamon, and these are so cute. I can't wait to take pictures of them. I'm definitely going to take a bunch of pictures of the sweets before I consume them. <laughs> And then the last item, yep, yeah, the last item is tickets for the Hogwarts Express. So let's open this up. So inside you get two of them so you can smuggle your muggle friend on the Hogwarts Express with you. And I like that it has like gold foil on it. It's very pretty. I like that they give you two of them. So that's all that comes in the acceptance letter gift box. This would make a great gift to give to someone who hasn't yet received their Hogwarts letter and it comes with like extra little treats and stuff and tickets. Obviously you need to get onto the platform. So I'm really excited about the fever fudge because that is completely new to me. <laughs> I, I mean, it's not new. I mean, I just never had it before. So I'm excited about it. Uh, comment down below and let me know what your favorite item was. And let's move on to the limited edition box. So the box with this is different than their regular box because obviously it says limited edition and the theme of the box is Hogwarts Express and it has you know, the Hogwarts Express as the border. And thank you, Doris, for packaging my box. My grandma's name is Doris, so, so I love that. <laughs> so first we have the t-shirt and I'm already digging it. It has like sunset colors kind of. And we see the flying, the Weasley flying car and some owls, and obviously the Hogwarts Express. And like I said, the color scheme reminds me of a sunset, so I really like that. And I like that it's a navy t-shirt. I love any dark colored shirts, so I really love this design. So we have a chocolate frog box, which I've already gotten two others of these, the one in the acceptance letter box and the one in the regular March box. So Easter's coming up, so I might give some to some friends and keep one for myself. So I'm not gonna open that up since I already showed it already in this video, I think. <laughs> and then we have this. It says Iconic Train Metallic Edition. So I'm assuming this is a Hogwarts Express uh, replica. Yep. Ooh, I really like that metallic red color. I actually have two replicas that look just like this, but none of them are metallic and I really like this metallic one. And the paint job looks good too. It even says Hogwarts Express on there. I love that color. That's a beautiful little replica. And then we have these. Okay, so we've got a pillow cover and obviously the Hogwarts Express is on it because everything's the Hogwarts Express. And I love that they put the Hogwarts castle in the background. And I kind of wish they put Hogwarts Express on there, but I mean, you know it's the Hogwarts Express, so it doesn't, it's not really needed. And the border is like brick and everything. I really like this design and I can't wait to put it on my day bed because that's where I put the pillow covers. I've gotten a few pillow covers from Geek Gear already and that's where they go because they're very cute. And then we have a print. And ooh, it, ooh, it looks like the design that they put on the bandana in the March wearable box. And now I have an imprint version because I was going to hang that uh, bandana up, but I'll just, you know, frame this and hang it up because I love this print. It is so beautiful. I guess like the colors are appealing to me. I mean, I have other Hogwarts Express prints but this is by far my favorite of them I guess because Hagrid's in it too I just I love it and the artist signed it and everything it's just so beautiful I love that it has like kind of paint strokes on it and stuff and like I said Hagrid in it it just makes it perfect it's beautiful oh yes we've got tea in this box and it's king's cross tea that's so cute i love the labels that they create for their teas i mean look at the little hogwarts express on the teacup and then the front of the train is there too i love putting these in my kitchen as a like a little decor piece to harry potter up the place and this is uh has black tea oolong 
tea, I don't know, uh, cornflower petals, and it's smoky black tea. So let's give it a sniff. Ooh, that smells strongly of smoke, which I guess is perfect because it's King's Cross tea and, you know, near trains, it smells like smoke. So that is the perfect flavor for that. And it has like these lavender sort of purpley bits in there with, you know, the brown bits and all that. Um, but I'm excited to try this and see if I like it. It's very, it smells very strongly of smoke. And we're getting to the end. All these worms. Oh, we have a pin. Hold on. We've got a pin of the Hogwarts Express, of course. <laughs> so we got a simple looking pin of the train. It doesn't have any details on it or anything, but you know. It's the Hogwarts Express. I'm gonna put this on my platform nine and three quarters book bag. I think that would look perfect on there. So a nice little pin. And then we've got some paper bits and there's a print on the bottom. I have such a mess on my bed. <laughs> So we've got another print of the Hogwarts Express, but this looks like, it looks like, it looks like a, um, a picture of the Hogwarts Express that's in the movie, like they took a picture of it. The other one looked more like a painting, you know what I mean? But I like that. So we've got the spoiler card, oh, we got some more train tickets. I already showed you what those look like in the acceptance litter box, but if you forgot. So I'll keep that in its packaging and give it to a friend. And then more advertisements. See the house elves is the next theme and it's already on sale. So I'll put all the information in the description box. I'm so excited because I love house elves. Dobby is one of my favorite characters. So I'm so excited for that. <laughs> so let's take a look at the spoiler letter. So here we are, and obviously there's no spoiler because they already put the whole house elves as the next theme. My favorite item in this box, oof, I think it's like a four-way tie between the shirts, the cushion, and this beautiful print, and where is, my bed is such a mess, what happened to the little, oh, and the little Hogwarts Express replica, this is my favorite, I have three now and this is my favorite one because of that metallic color it's so beautiful i love this so yeah comment down below and let me know what your favorite item was and thanks so much for watching